Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. Today I prepared this butter chicken. We really love Indian food and uh, me and my husband used to live in the Czech Republic but now we live in the US. And with Indian food here in the US we have one issue that all the recipes seem to include uh, heavy cream. I prefer to have yogurt in uh, the butter chicken or in the Indian uh, recipes. So that's why I started making it myself. And I created this recipe that I think uh, works really well. So if you're interested in how I make my butter chicken or mork makani, please continue watching and let me know if you like this recipe, if you try it, or let me know in the comment section if you have any questions. I really appreciate if you do hit the like button or the subscribe button if you like to see more videos on my channel. And you can also check, we started uh, the channel in December, we already have like 7 or 8 videos. So please check it out and thank you so much. I start by cutting the chicken into cubes. I put the chicken into a bowl and I will put salt. I will now prepare the marinating mix. So for the seasoning, I have several herbs here that are good for Indian cuisine. You don't need all of these, but this is what I'm gonna use today. So I will put one teaspoon of garam masala, two teaspoons of curry powder, it doesn't have to be precise, one teaspoon of smoked paprika, if you want it spicy, add chili powder. If you don't, just avoid that. I will add one teaspoon, two teaspoons of turmeric and cumin. I mix all the herbs together and I will use half of this and sprinkle over the chicken. I will mix it and I will add some white yogurt. One, two, three, and mix it together. I will add one more spoon. You see that they are super heat, so you just see the amount. It just has to be covered very well. In the yogurt, we will be adding it to the sauce later. Now we have the marinade ready. If you have the time, make this in the afternoon, put it in the fridge and you can marinate it for a few hours. It's not necessary, so I'm just making it in the evening right before making the actual meal. So I will put it in the fridge for now. I will take onion now and I will cut it. It doesn't have to be fine pieces because we're going to be blending the sauce later. I add two spoons of ghee butter in the pot and let it melt. Put the onions in and let it saute for five minutes. Stir occasionally. After five minutes, open a can of tomatoes. I have this fire roasted uh, tomato can. You can use regular tomatoes. So have it already prepared and opened. Decrease the temperature to medium. And we're gonna put the remaining amount of the spices in the pot and let it saute for a minute and keep stirring it. Mm, smells great. We don't want to burn the spices because when you burn spices they actually go very bitter. So make sure you don't give it more than one minute and that you, you keep stirring it also. So after a minute you will you can add the diced tomatoes. Mm. 
I'll mix it together. I will add a little bit of water. I will just rinse this uh, can with the water. So we yeah, rinse the can with water, a little bit of water. Add that. And now I will add a small cinnamon stick. And we will also need some chicken broth. So I will use uh, this bouillon. And I will use one heaped teaspoon. Mix together. And we are going to let it cook now for 20 minutes. So now it's been almost 20 minutes. I tasted the sauce and it needs a little bit of sugar. So take one teaspoon of sugar and add it in. Remove the cinnamon stick, turn it down and blend it together. So mix the chicken in. Add three cloves of garlic into the sauce and let it cook for 25 minutes. In the meantime, we can start preparing the rice. So I will use basmati rice with the Indian recipe and you just cook it based on the instructions on your package. And the butter chicken is done. If you like cilantro, I have chopped some fresh cilantro because we absolutely love cilantro and I put some on top here and I really hope that you will enjoy this recipe it's very simple you just need the right spices you don't have to even use as many as I have today and it will still come out great thank you so much have a nice day take care